Hi guys, Jin Dobre. Welcome back to Poland Ka Safar. My name is Ritu. So today we are going to discuss about how I spent my winters and what I liked about Poland winters and what I didn't like about it. So you can see that it's nice and sunny and I'm very happy because the sun is showing up every day these days. So the spring is here. Everything's so beautiful and I'm happy. So I am from Bangalore. I grew up there in Bangalore all my life. So for me winters is like less than 15 degrees. So for me winter started here in end of September when the temperature suddenly dropped to like the previous day the temperature was around 32 and I was all happy and enjoying it and the next day the temperature just dropped to 20 degrees and jackets were on like people were wearing jackets and from then onwards from 20 degrees onwards it's just started lowering down 15 14 and by the end of September for me winters had started but actually the winters didn't start but I started feeling cold by the end of September because the temperature was around less than 15 then so the beginning of the October month, uh, the autumn had set in and all the trees were shedding its leaf. It was turning yellow, it was turning orange, it was beautiful for me to see. And I was quite enjoying it, though the weather, the weather, I would not say it was uh, very cold. At the same time, it was not very uh, hot. Like it was not warm at all. It was cold. You need a jacket when you go out, but you could enjoy when it was sunny. You will not feel so cold. And uh, more than that, it was very beautiful. In October, as the days passed, the temperature kept dropping. And by the end of October, the time changed and we became four and a half hours ahead of India. Then we reached November and it was very cold for me. It was freezing cold for me because the temperature was less than that of 10 degrees then. In November, I experienced my first snow and it I felt beautiful. It was a magical experience for me. I still like snow. I think uh, I will always like snow. And I, I stayed in Poland and I enjoyed the snow. But the only drawback I felt was it started to get gloomy day by day. It was, I went like around two, three weeks, weeks without seeing the sun and that was not acceptable at all for me. I was like, how it is even possible? I'm seeing clouds every day. It was so gloomy. Sun would show up once in two weeks, once in three weeks. Uh, yes, I f did feel very irritated. I did feel, I would not say I, I would feel very depressed, but I felt very lazy to do anything. I just wanted to sit in one corner and do nothing basically. Our homes were kept uh, warm because the heater was on but yet I felt very I felt very lazy because of this gloomy weather. I just wanted to sit in one corner and not do anything or eat something. So yeah it was a little difficult. It was a challenge for me to push myself up from the sofa and get on to do some work. Even outside uh, you know it doesn't snow every day here so you know, outside is not so beautiful. It is mostly gray and black because always you can see the clouds. Uh, you would not enjoy the weather because it's very cold. Who would want to go for a walk, I felt. The trees had completely shut off their leaves. It was all black and gray. And walking was again pain because if it's windy, you cannot walk because it gets very cold. So the, uh, in November, I think we touched minus temperature as well. So it's not a problem if you are well dressed, if you are properly you dressed with layers, you're wearing your warmers, then you can go out and uh, you can be there outside for a long time. In November, I was just getting used to the harsh winters. And then comes December where I, I feel it even more because uh, 3.30 was the sunset. Sunrise was around uh, 7.45, 8. So if you're going to office, you will not see the sun at all. Like you're going to office in dark and coming back in dark. So that was the scenario. Uh, it was hitting me too much. Uh, I kind of not, I didn't like it. I was also uh, complaining a lot to my husband. Uh, what is the weather? What is this weather and all that? Uh, yeah, I was uh, feeling irritated and uh, not liking it, but you can't help it. And then uh, just, I just kept going on and then Christmas came. I enjoyed Christmas here. So you, I could see the Christmas market. There was beautiful Christmas decorations. I enjoyed the hot mulled wine here. I was just exploring Poland. I was explore, exploring Warsaw, what it looks like during Christmas. I was also buying few winter jackets. Uh, yeah, I was doing my winter shopping, all that. So I just kept myself a little busy. 
know to do, did some soft shopping uh, went to see the decorations so just waiting the december gets over january might be better and then came new year so the 1st of jan was very surprising actually the 1st of jan uh, it the temperature was around 17 to 18 degrees and it was sunny so basically it was not cold at all it's temperature we are fa uh, facing now like now it's spring and it's around 13 degrees but the 1st of jan it was around 17 to 18 degrees and that was not a temperature in last 10 years first time in last 10 years they recorded such a high temperature on january 1st but then uh, we enjoyed on January 1st and I was just hoping in my mind this temperature stays and doesn't drop. But of course January and February are again very cold, very very cold uh, months here in Poland. Mostly the temperature is below 5 so yeah I had to somehow adjust to it. Uh, I started feeling it too much then so we, I, in order to just distract myself I started to plan trips. So I thought, why not go somewhere and uh, enjoy yourself and all. So what happens, uh, I didn't want to go to a warmer place also. The reason is I wanted to challenge myself and see if I could really enjoy the snow and see the winters basically. First, uh, I planned of going on a winter hike. So we went to Karpach and we uh, climbed to Nishka mountain, which I've already uploaded a video. I'll insert it here if you want to see that was a very nice experience and I enjoyed it it was beautiful so yeah I started to like the snow I actually like the snow too much then yeah I kind of enjoyed the hike also there so then we went to Tromso and uh, Tromso is the northernmost part in Norway near the Arctic Circle that was a beautiful experience of my life and Norway is beautiful so I would say Norway is a true winter experience So because I, as soon as I stepped into Tromsø, the temperature I faced was below minus 15 degrees. So that was the temperature, it suddenly hit me, oh, it's kind of cold here, more than Poland. In Tromsø, I saw mountains of snow, it, like the car was entirely covered by the snow. It kept on snowing, it's kept on snowing in Tromsø. Uh, but somehow I like it and I was enjoying myself we went for, we went to snowmobile then we went to see the northern lights again the northern lights experience was different uh, though you're wearing uh, full layers you're wearing your snow boots you're wearing you're covering yourself fully from top to bottom but the experience of standing in minus 15 below temperature on the snow and trying and waiting to see the northern lights it's a uh, it's painful actually it's painful and exciting at the same time because you're waiting to see something and at the same time you're feeling the cold even if you're fully dressed because you're not moving it's it's a it's a painful and an exciting experience in itself so yeah we have to upload the Tromso video I will uh, share it soon after coming back from Tromso uh, this, the, it started to get a little better and the daylight started to increase a little bit so the sunset sunset was around uh, 3 30 before now it started to get at 4 35 things were getting better but the cold was persistent it's a prolonged winter then i was like oh my god when is this getting over when will when will i see the sun so there were days uh, where you could uh, you know see the sun for at least for two hours and i was like oh my god sun is up and i used to go walking and it used to feel nice so I took advantages of those days and I went to walking just to feel better. In March, it was getting too much and I was like, I can't take it anymore. Come on. Uh, like from, for me, it was like September end. So it's just ch ch the September, October, November, December, January, February and March is also cold. And I was like, no, I just cannot take this anymore. But somehow we need to push through. I did that. And then finally we reached April thinking oh my god now spring will come spring will come uh, in april the time also changes and we are three and a half hours behind india so then uh, again in april it started to snow a bit and that was actually the last snow of winters and kind of enjoyed it i was here and i kind of went out and enjoyed the snow then temperature starts to get better mid of april mid of april it starts to rise again it was 13 started with 11 13 15 and once uh, i remember the temperature was around 22 degrees and it was sunny and you don't need jackets when it's 22 degrees and it was sunny so i went out without jacket and it was so nice 
In April, what I noticed when I went to morning walks is uh, the leaves started coming out, the birds are chirping. There's like you can see more life coming for the trees and surrounding. It's it's a different experience. There's so much life all around. You can see. For now, end of April, it's been beautiful. Uh, I'm so surprised. The sun has been showing up every day for now. <laughs> I just hope that doesn't go. I don't jinx it, but yeah, the sun is up. and i'm happy because i'm happy my husband is also happy in uh, april we went we went ahead and planned our iceland trip and it was beautiful like it was amazing amazing i need to make a video on it which we will soon do it you cannot keep tripping every day every time every week so just whatever po possible with you just go, go ahead like plan some trip leave the country keep yourself busy be active take vitamin d supplements yes that's very important consult your doctor and take the vitamin d supplements enjoy the snow it comes and uh, yeah that's how that's how i dealt with the winters here i am just looking forward to the summers uh, because the summers daylight will be uh, the sun will be up around 4 am and sunset will be around 9:30 10 so that will uh, again be beautiful so one very important thing i learned from here is uh, whatever the weather is people still go out for a walk i have seen people running they don't skip their uh, practice they still go out for running they do their morning chores mothers take their babies out that was uh, again very very commendable so they don't complain sit and complain like i think i did so yeah that's what i learned from people here whatever the weather is like the life should go on so yeah winters were tough for me i felt they were tough um, but life has to go on whether it's winter summer spring autumn life has to go on i'll enjoy the summers as much as possible yes so i'll see you in the next video jinko ya do vidzinya